Hey, hey, everybody, this is Amanda, and um, basically, I'm just going to give you the quick Reader's Digest version of what's going on with me this week in training. Um, first things first, big shout out to um, Athletic Extreme. They are my uh, sponsor. They take good care of me, so I wanted to say uh, thank you to them. Also want to say thank you to Strong and Far. Um, very excited to be affiliated with them, definitely in some good companies, some very strong athletes there. So um, make sure you check out my training blogs with them. And if you're watching this, you probably already have. And um, check out the other athletes' training blogs because there's uh, something you can learn from everybody that's there. So with that said, um, quick little blurb on what's going on with me this week. Um, I started back in the gym uh, today. Uh, today was my squat day. Actually focused a lot on front squats. Um, had to do them with the... Uh, I guess California style where you cross your hands this way. I have a thing going on in my wrist right now, so I couldn't really, you know, get my hands back that way. Um, didn't really go too heavy in weight. I stayed at about 185, was was about the heaviest I went. But I really wanted to concentrate this week on form. It's um, really important, it's, and it's as, you know, the more I squat, the more I, I feel it every time took me a long time to get my head around breaking parallel and, and that's just because I came over from you know the whole bodybuilding side of things and you know when I really started dropping my ass to my calves and finding that sweet spot where all of a sudden everything just kind of clicks and all your muscles are jiving at one time and you can just bam explode up out of the hole that's when I really started squatting good and you know, it's something that, you know, I really have to work on. And this week, I really wanted to, to work on it front squat-wise because, just to switch it up, because last week I did back squats more. Um, and so, like I said, I stayed at about 185, was the heaviest I went. I must have done a gazillion sets. I don't, I don't even know at this point. But, um, you know, it's just an awesome feeling when you get down there and you feel that groove and you're just like, yeah, and then bam, and then you just come right back up. Um it's, you know, we've all been guilty of uh, squatting shallow, and there was, you know, a time probably not too long ago where I was doing that, and it's, um, it's amazing the difference. You can't really get the benefit out of the squat if you constantly have the tension in your legs, and the only way to, to break out of that is to pass your knees. So, um, that was what I worked on uh, for the first half of uh, training today. And then the other half was um, I did some uh, hang cleans and then some uh, high snatch pulls, which was, um, you know, a, a pretty good way to finish off the day. So I feel pretty good about that. I had a good workout. It took a little longer than I had wanted to. I probably should have taken, you know, timed it a little bit better. But um, I feel good about that. Tomorrow is going to be uh, overhead day, push press day. So that should be good. Um, Tuesday is supposed to have awesome weather. So I will be throwing something on Tuesday. I think it's going to be in the 70s. So I'm probably going to take my ass to the field and throw a bunch of stuff. And um, then I'm going to finish it out with uh, deadlifts the day after that. And then I go back to work for four days. So anywho, that's where I'm at right now on training. I hope everybody is training hard and training often. And um just uh, stay with it. I'll keep you guys posted. Looks like my first games are probably going to be in the month of April. I believe I'm going to do Tartan Fest down in um, South Carolina. And then I'm going to do the uh, Lock Norman games, which are actually going to be in Charlotte. So those will be my first two games. Lock Norman is going to be like the, the main one. So, so April is going to be when I start throwing. Anywho, hope you all have a good night. I'm going to go eat something. Later.